Hey, this is Lewis from Breakdance, and in this video, I want to show you how to add a quantity input globally to all of your products list. So right next to the Add to Cart button, you're going to get a quantity input. By default in Breakdance, the quantity input will not appear. If you use the mini cart, you click Add to Cart, you then get the mini cart where you can then update the quantity from the mini cart. But maybe you want to give the user the ability to choose the quantity right next to the Add to Cart button. Let's enable that in Breakdance. So to do that, we're going to go into the Global Styles. So you go to Breakdance and then click Edit Global Styles. And you'll find the option for the quantity input under Global Settings, WooCommerce. Then we're going to go to Other. We're going to go to Products List. And then we're going to scroll down to Quantity Input. And we're going to choose Enable. And this setting won't take effect until you actually save and refresh. So I'm going to go ahead and save, and then I'm going to exit out of browse mode. And here we are back on the front end. And as you can see, we have quantity inputs in line on the cart page, or sorry, on the uh, shopping page and in any other products list you add. So let's go ahead and choose a quantity. Let's say we want four. Let's click add to cart and voila. Well, we already had three in the cart because I added three when I was making this video earlier. But okay, let's, let's do it again. Five, a different product add to cart and there we go we've added five to the cart and of course if we came back to this page with five in the cart and we chose three more add to cart there you go we then have eight in the cart so there you go that's how to get quantity inputs on the shop page and in other products lists